Okay, here the customer will arrive in the particular one window to drive according to the Python distribution with mean of 10 minutes, then service time per customer exponential with mean of 6 minutes. Okay, the whatever distribution is there of 10 minutes, but the service which is to be required, that is of 6 minutes. Then the space in front of the window can be accumulated only three vehicles, including the service one. Okay, means there will be a parking space is provided. That space is there with respect to that of three vehicles. Among that, one vehicle will be of service one, serviced one. Okay, whatever the service is to be done. Other vehicle have to wait outside this space. Okay. If any other vehicles are there, those are should be wait outside that space what is to be provided. Okay, then calculate the probability that arriving the customer can drive directly to the space in front of the window. Okay, second one is the probability that an arriving customer will have to wait outside the directed space. Then third one is how long arriving customer is expected to wait before getting the service. Okay, these three parameters are valid. Okay, all of you go through this once, whatever you noted down. Okay, according to that, you have to make the evaluation of the particular parameters. Okay, all of listening, Mina, raise your hand. Which is the lambda value here? Which is the mu value? Lambda is equal to 6, that the customer per hour, then mu value equal to 10. Lambda is equal to 6, then mu equal to 10. Is this color? Color is comfortable, na? Is it uh, visible? Lambda equal to 6, then mu equal to 10. Okay, then you want to make the evaluation. The probability of the customer arrive directly to the space in front of the window. That how to evaluate. Okay, for that, the direct formula is there. By using that formula, we are going to make the evaluation of the particular duration of the time which is to be required to accomplish that work. Okay, this formula you have to remember. Based on your requirement, you are going to make the evaluation. Okay, we got to know what the value of the lambda, what the value of the mu. Okay, then what we have to evaluate? We have to make the evaluation corresponding to that of the probability of the arriving of customer can drive directly to the space of in front of the window. Okay, lambda is equal to 6, then mu equal to 10. Then what is that probability? There will be three spaces are provided. Okay, that probability is only three possibility. Others have to wait. So that P0 plus P1 plus P2. Okay, that is equal to 1 minus lambda by mu plus lambda by mu into 1 minus lambda by mu plus lambda by mu square into 1 minus lambda by mu. Okay, once you solve this one, 
we will get the equivalent equation of this. 1 minus lambda by mu into 1 plus lambda by mu plus lambda by mu square. Okay, this is the what? The formula. Okay, you know the value of lambda now? You know the value of the mu. Substitute these values. That is 1 minus 6 by 10, 1 plus 6 by 10, 6 by 10 whole square. All of you getting this answer? Verify. 98 divided by 125. That is equal to 0.784. Verify once. Take your calculator. Simply don't copy. If mistake is there, you can tell. Any doubt? Note it down. Once you note it down, raise your hand. Lambda and mu value will be taken with respect to that of the number of customers okay, per hour. Keep this in mind. Okay, second thing what you have to evaluate? The probability of the arriving of the customer will have to wait outside the directed space. That I have to evaluate. Okay, we know the value of this now already. What the time is to be required to be get serviced. Then if you subtracted this, that itself is the what? The probability of the time is to be waiting outside. That is 1 minus P0 plus P1 plus P2 equal to 1 minus 0.784, which is equal to 0.216. Okay, this is the what? The probability of the time is to be required to wait outside. Okay, this is the second. Copy that. Okay, next what which it is required to make the evaluation corresponding to the expected waiting time of the customer before getting the service. Okay, that is E of W Q equal to lambda divided by mu into mu minus lambda. Okay, you know the lambda value 6, then mu value 10. Then you will get 
6 power 40. Okay, that is 30 by 20 per hour because the lambda is the number of customers per hour. Okay, then mu is number of customers that is also be per hour. Then whatever the time you are going to evaluate here now, that is also be in terms of hour. Multiply that is with uh, 60, then you will get around 9 minutes. Then what is the time which is to be required to be wait before getting the service based on the what? The customer arrival in the particular task completion. All of you got my point? Is this clear? Yes. 